A house under $400,000 in Edmonton? Yes, this is it. We're standing in here and we are in Rosenthal. So Rosenthal is located in West Edmonton, really close to the Costco and the River Cree. We are bounded by White Mud Drive, Winterburn Road, 92nd Ave, and 231 Street. So we're here in Rosenthal. We've been here before. I know this is your hood. Yes, I live here. Yeah, so what are some really awesome amenities? I know it has some great ones for families. Yeah, so Rosenthal is so family friendly. It has a spray park. So when we used to live in Secord, we used to bike over here all the mm -hmm. time. Yeah. So you've got a spray park, a playground. You've got a very active community league here as well. So there's a lot of activities in the winter. They have an ice rink here. Um, and then there's trails all around. There's lots of walking trails. I back onto walking trails, so I see people walking their dogs. There are a lot of dogs in Rosenthal. <laughs> I think more dogs than children. It's a family actually. thing. It's a family thing to have a dog, right? With yeah. No children yeah, of have course. Dogs. Of course. So yeah. it's very active here, and people can get so easy access to the White Mud and Winterburn and Anthony Henday. So it's very convenient. Right. Location. And what's the amenities just right across um, the White Mud? Is it? So there's the Grange amenities. Yeah, the so Grange. That's for the Costco. Yeah. And then there's the Grange. So there's the Safeway and the Original Joe's. Like Super close, right? Change place. Yeah, really yeah. close. What, five minutes? Not even. Depending on yeah. traffic on Winterburn Road. Right. But just so you know, there are two exits out of Rosenthal and they put lights at them. So now it's actually easy to get up. Actually, there's Easier. three technically yeah. exits because now we have the exit kind of closer to the traffic circles where it's called Rosewood. And I don't know if it's Seacourt or Rosenthal. <laughs> it's a mix. Uh, it's a strange one that's developed by Melcore, which Rosenthal is developed by Melcore. Um, and actually that area is really close to where we are. And that's where that new rec center is going to go. Oh, nice. So the Lewis Farms Rec Center yeah. is going to get built. So townhouses, single family homes, what are you going to find here in this neighborhood? So Rosenthal has a good mix of homes and it is a newer area, right? Mm. So it's still relatively new. And so most of the homes here are built in the last 10 years. Yeah. Um, probably actually a little bit less because when we lived in Rosenthal or in Secord, when we drive by here, it was just a big empty field. Yeah. So <laughs> the homes in here are new. You can build still in here. Wow. Um, there's almost no new builds left. Now, yeah. the new builds that you can build are zero lot line homes. So you can get the front attached double garage. You can buy a house like this actually as a house on its own. Oh, wow. Wow. Um, I don't know if those are all gone and those cost quite a bit more. They're in the 450s, almost 500s oh, now. So this is Builder a Builder prices have gone up, yeah. yeah. Uh, you're gonna find laned homes, so the garage is in the back with the little front porches. You're gonna find walkout properties here. You're gonna find also apartments. There are two, one at the front of Rosenthal called the Jade and another one that's a rental, just kind of really close to here actually. Mm -hmm. So you've got other townhouses that are similar to this, but built by Paysetter and by street side. So there's a lot of mix and there's a lot of different double garage attached homes, primarily single family homes. Yeah. I would say about, I almost want to say 90% are single family. And then if anything, 10%, maybe 5% can be apartments. Okay, so with that, and we talked about how many dogs there are, there's obviously a lot of people, lots of families. Like yes, lots of families here. Um, I find that they, they have the townhouses with condo fees that look like barns. Oh. Um, they're quite, they're right by the playground. Oh, actually. I'm gonna have to check it out. <laughs> that demographic, and I know this because I'm inside too, yeah. there's a lot of people with no children that live there. Yeah. A lot of professionals that live in there. Um, and they have condo fees, they, they've got the double garage on the main like the main floor and then goes up right. to more levels. Yes. Um, and so that also some of those back on to the walking path. So yeah. there's a lot of walking paths that kind of like intertwine and Melcourt did a really good job developing this neighborhood. Excellent. All right, so this house you can buy here because we have three bedrooms upstairs and the primary bedroom's quite large. It's got a set of bench at the window. You've got a nice size walk-in closet. You also have quartz countertops in the bathroom and a stand-up shower with tile surround. Then on the upstairs, you'll also find upstairs laundry, which is very convenient, and two more bedrooms and a full bathroom. On the main floor, you're going to find an open concept layout yeah. with the open to above staircase, which is, you know, a unique layout that Homes by Abbey put in some of these homes. And in the back of the house, you'll have the kitchen, so you have the ability 
to watch your kids play while you do your dishes, <laughs> or maybe they get to do the dishes and watch you <laughs> and, like, pull them on. Um, but it's a nice white kitchen, which is what everybody wants these days, is that white kitchen with the quartz countertops. You've got some pots and pans, drawers, stainless and steel appliances, fully finished everything. So landscaping is done, fencing is done, and you've got a double detached garage out back. And this home is ready for you to buy here.